Hey everyone, I just want to show you a couple of the functions that we're going to have to use today to make the porch sign. So when you open the Cricut Design Space app, this is the screen you're going to see. You just want to make a new project by either clicking the left button over here that says new project or the green button in the top right corner that says new project. Once you're in the new project screen, uh, today we're going to be using the image button. This gives you access to the Cricut image bank. You can choose whatever icon you want for your sign. I'm going to use a snowflake. So you just search snowflake, Christmas tree, or whatever else it is that you want to use. And once you select an image, it'll be highlighted in green. Some of them are free. Some of them have a price. If you have Cricut access, you won't see a price down here. They'll all be free for you if it has this green A on it. Once you've selected your images, you want to click insert image in the bottom right hand corner and then you'll have your images on the screen. You can just select them one at a time so you can see them. You'll also need to use the text button. You just write whatever you want on your sign. I'm going to choose welcome and then you can change the font with the font button up here in the left hand side. If you leave it on all, it'll show you the Cricut fonts, some of which are for sale. If you select system, you'll see the ones that are already on your computer and free to use. You're also going to want to add a shape. I always change it to the size of product I'm, uh, project I'm working on. So today it's going to be 5.75 inches by 24 inches. And if for whatever reason your program isn't set to inches, you can change it by clicking the three buttons up here in the left, clicking on settings, and then clicking on imperial and just saving it.